great, we have another error. This is good because it gives us more to look at. So make failed to build some targets. And we see the error right here um, on the output. Sometimes you have to search through the terminal a little bit to find where the error was, especially if you're building with a lot of threads. But the error is that the resource at config preferred APN appears in overlay, but not in the base package. Use add resource to add. So if we go to our device Samsung JFLTE TMO folder, and um, we go through our packages, providers, telephony, res, values, and we find this config.xml, we'll open that up and take a look. Now, how to find this? Well, you can just use the search object to look for config preferred APN, and it'll lead you to this file. But you see this, this string name is saying, hey, I want to overlay the base package configuration preferred APN to be fast.tmobile.com 310.260. That's what I want it to overlay over the default preferred APN. But what the uh, compiler is saying is that there is no config preferred APN string or tag in Android build for SlimROM. So this actually would be overlaying nothing. We're, we're not going to rewrite over the top of something that doesn't exist. So you have a choice here. You could delete it and take it out since it didn't exist, or you can use add resource to add that to um, your build. I, I prefer to do the add resource. There's a reason we put this in here. Let's go ahead and add that resource in. Now, since it wasn't being used before, it may still not be used now. Just adding the resource doesn't necessarily mean that it's going to be used. And uh, that's actually kind of a subject for deeper discussion. But I want to show you how to add that resource. So here we go. Uh, let's see. We want to um, add resource. And essentially what we're going to do is we're going to make it a type of uh, String. And essentially, we're taking that string name tag and everything we saw that we just commented out. That's what that um, less than explanation dash dash. And then afterwards, we put that dash dash greater than symbol. We've commented that line out. Notice that it turned blue, so it's not being read anymore by the compiler. And we're just going to take that and rearrange it. So we have this add resource type is a string, because it was a string before. The name of that string is uh, the, the name that it, we want it to be. And um, we can use the greater and less than. And then we're going to say uh, the end of add resource with this forward slash add resource. So we start with add resource. We're going to end with add resource. Notice the line above started with string and ended with slash string. And then we're going to put the, the line in the middle of all the stuff that, that we wanted it to say. So we just rearrange the the whole um, line above in a way to add that resource instead of just saying, go ahead and overwrite that resource. Because that resource didn't exist before. It wasn't found in the base package. So um, we can save that. And notice if we open it, uh, it'll open up in a browser. And uh, we see their add resources in there. So we've saved that. Uh, if you have any questions about using add resource, you can always head to my website, thealaskalinuxuser.com or thealaskalinuxuser.wordpress.com. Both will take you to the same place. And um, you can uh, read up more about add resource. Super handy way to add something in if it hasn't been um, put into the overlay. Now, since it wasn't in the base package, it may not be used. And again, that's the subject for further discussion. But I just wanted you to be aware that this is how you can add a resource to a package. 